today is Tuesday, April the 23rd, and it also happens to be a full moon. I sat down to do a reading, and I want to share with you that the Emperor card came through. So I decided, you know what, I do want to do this reading, and I want to do this reading with you, if that's okay. Um, because this is a very interesting card to see during a full moon, at least for me. Typically, we would associate full moon energy with this sort of heightened femininity. And yet for the Emperor to come through, it has a very interesting sort of alchemy to it. Usually the Emperor is like the full manifestation and embodiment of masculine energy. It's that perfect counterpart to the full moon. But I cannot stop feeling as though we should explore and truly kind of tap into what the Emperor has to say to us on this full moon. We are going to be using the Fyodor Pavlov Tarot deck. It's super pretty, gold foiled edges. This deck is incredibly magical, and we're going to use that today. Now remember, we have our Emperor here. Now let's pull some cards. You guys, I, this is incredible. Okay, so we have our Emperor, of course. We have the Two of Cups. We have the High Priestess. And we have the Sun. There is something alchemical taking place here. This is a very profound type of a reading. Um, for us to have three major arcana cards, this is not something to take lightly. Right now, celestially, spiritually, I would say primordially, there's something going on. There's some type of change which is taking place here. To see the Emperor and the High Priestess with the Sun card, as I like to lay the cards down, both the Two of Cups and the High Priestess showed up side by side. Two, two, would be four, and the Emperor, number four. Starting off, I would like to say, I feel as though the Emperor is kind of giving us a heads up. Moving into this month, you know, into this moon cycle and into the next full moon, I think the Emperor is trying to tell us that we, I think we're going to meet someone. There's some type of partnership. I'm not sure if this is someone that you've known before, but it looks like there's going to be some type of union or some type of an agreement. Now, this Two of Cups, um, it shows a moon, and then this cup wielder is got a sun. And we see the sun. While we know that the High Priestess is typically associated with the moon, and she's always depicted with the moon at her feet, and here we see the moon actually on her crown or tiara. Something's happening. Something's coming something big, and it looks as though it's going to be something that you've actually been waiting for for quite some time now. Whomever this is that's coming into the picture is actually bringing with them the desired outcome which you thought was not, you previously didn't think it was possible, and I'm seeing now the Emperor is telling us that it actually is possible. We do still get some of that sacred feminine energy here with the High Priestess. I feel as though she's saying, I've been doing the work behind the scenes. I've been sewing together the stars for you and for this outcome. I've been working to sort of bring this person in and you've just needed to remain patient and now they're coming. What's interesting about the Fyodor Pavlov Tarot is that the Emperor is actually depicted not sitting down but standing up. So an active participant rather than a passive participant. I think this emperor was saying, you don't necessarily need the guidance because I gave the orders and you actually listened. You are usually so stubborn and yet this time when I gave the command, you were already there and you were ready to do as I said. The High Priestess is saying, I, we've been working to bring this person in, and what's coming is that desired outcome that you've always wanted. This is big stuff happening here. 
Also, none of these cards came out to be in the reversed position, which tells me that if it feels like it's too good to be true, in this case, it's not. Keep your eyes and your ears open this month. And also, open yourself up to the goodness that's coming in. The sun doesn't show up unless there's a heck of a lot of goodness coming in. This is going to be a good month for you, honey. I can see it. I can. It's here. Wow, I'm actually just like sitting here sort of speechless over this. This is a big, big deal. Love this. Oh my gosh. Okay. Sorry. Super excited. Oh, I love doing readings. These are so fun. In this deck, you guys, please, if you don't already have it, this is the Fedor Pavlov Tarot. I don't know how many times I'm going to say it. Please get it. Do yourself a favor. It's absolutely brilliant. Absolutely beautiful. The cardstock is perfect quality. Thank you so much for watching and for being here, and I will hopefully see you again very soon. Enjoy your full moon. Keep your eyes open. There's some goodness coming your way. Bye-bye.